Even though Santa only delivers presents one day a year, he and his reindeer team face a variety of occupational hazards. Here at NASP, we thought it would be a good idea to put together a short list for Santa so that he could avoid injury this season and make it back to Miss Claus and the elves at the North Pole. Let's take a look at the potential hazards Santa may encounter in this holiday episode of NASP's Safety News Break. Let's first talk about Santa's sleigh and reindeer. They are surely an important part of Santa's ability to deliver gifts to children across the world. Before leaving the North Pole, Santa should perform a pre-flight safety check on the sleigh to ensure all parts are in working order. This also includes the health and safety of his reindeer. Before takeoff, the reindeer must be properly groomed and fed, and don't forget to polish Rudolph's nose for maximum illumination. PPE is a big deal for Santa once he begins his journey. He will need to wear the proper eye protection to avoid snow blindness. His boots must also be non-slip to have the proper traction and keep his feet dry on rooftops. The proper gloves and jacket will also protect Santa against the elements and help avoid frostbite. Delivering gifts and lifting that big bag of toys must take a toll on Santa's body. Before delivery, Santa should conduct some stretching to loosen up his muscles. We hope that Santa is lifting with his legs when placing gifts under the Christmas tree. Navigating through so many tight chimneys is no easy task. Luckily, Santa has received training on confined space entry and knows how to recognize potential hazards such as fires. Santa definitely encounters a variety of hazards during his deliveries. We hope that during his return home, he checks his weather app to avoid potential storms. Keeping a low altitude will also help him avoid any aircraft in the skies as well. What do you think about Santa's safety procedures? Where can he improve? Let us know in the comments section below, and be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons. We here at NASP hope that you and your family enjoy a safe and Merry Christmas.